don't get me wrong on this, I'm not one of the people who will stick absolutely to DDoS 2 in any sort of, in an actual game where, you know, you play and then you die and you wait for the next round. I like to play all the maps, most of the maps in that situation. I don't like just playing DDoS 2 over and over and over and over and over and over, and over, and over again, like a lot of people do. But, um, I've spent quite a lot of time on deathmatch servers that are DDoS 2 just constantly and it gets me into a very nice state of mind that is probably unhealthy but just, I just know every everywhere on that map and it's fucking perfect for that setup and I really like deathmatch even though I'm slightly ashamed of it just because it seems like Tardo Counter-Strike or Counter-Strike um, but I do it and I love it Just I've, I'm really enjoying Gun Game lately which is another example I feel of Retardo Counter-Strike but, <laughs> when a new Counter-Strike game comes out, I, I promise I'll play it properly. I promise, I promise. Um, I don't really like D-Dust though. Like, the original D-Dust, I think it's a little, I don't know. I've I played it so much, getting flashbanged down that stupid, when you go left and there's the thing. And then if you go the other way, which I liked doing with my AK-47, you get sniped. And that's just super good with the AK-47, so I always wanted to go that way, because sometimes you can knock them off and feel fucking amazing. But I never felt... I don't know, it doesn't uh, doesn't do well for me. I'm sort of slightly rash. And that map is very much... It pays to not ever do anything risky. And uh, I'm not such a fan of those kind of maps. <laughs> 